Uh, no, the short answer to that is, is no, we don't. And uh, we don't have enough testing capacity uh, now uh, because uh, in an ideal world I would like to test absolutely everybody uh, that wants a, a test immediately. So and, when, and so, when will uh, we so, have so let's, let's, let's be Let's be in, in, in no doubt that, uh, however, that the, uh, there has been a massive increase in, in testing capacity. Uh, it's gone up from... Uh, 2000 I acknowledge March that, Prime Minister. To, to, to following the Chairman's um, directions, um, let's, um, let's and, consider and, and when, when will the capacity be in place? We will have, we'll be up at 500,000 by the end of October. And national lockdown. Uh, Julian and I think it would be a uh, completely wrong for this country. Can uh, we afford it, Prime Minister? And I very much doubt that the financial consequences would be anything but uh, disastrous. I think that many people. Uh, are seeking to uh, get a test in the in the hope that uh, they can thereby be released uh, to get on uh, with their lives in in the normal way. And uh, people who uh, have uh, come into contact with someone who has tested positive, for instance, uh, they're seeking to get a test uh, to ensure that they that they're okay to, Is that to get away. And that is perfectly reasonable. Uh, and I understand why people are doing that. But the advice and the guidance is that people should seek a test, not in those circumstances, but when they have symptoms.